The Food and Drug Administration has launched an investigation over concerns about kids getting a boost from caffeine-enhanced foods. Wrigley recently announced the launch of its new Alert Energy Caffeine Gum, which contains about the same amount of caffeine as a half cup of coffee. That it promises, quote, the right energy right now. Health officials say that they will look at the direct impact on children's health and take action if necessary. The FDA says that it needs to basically test the safety effects of caffeine on children and teens and make regulations if necessary. Wrigley isn't the first to make a stimulant enhanced chewing gum, but it will be the first with Wrigley's name and marketing strength behind it, making it the most widely distributed gum. Food Safety News reports the last time the administration approved caffeine additives to food was in cola in the 1950s. Caffeine is included in the list of ingredients that are, quote, generally recognized as safe. But the FDA says the market has changed. This recent investigation over Wrigley's gum comes after several energy drinks were suspected in at least 25 deaths and 150 illnesses. One investigation surrounded the death of a 14-year-old Maryland girl who reportedly went into cardiac arrest after drinking two 24-ounce cans of the caffeinated drink, though the company said she had a pre-existing heart condition. Wrigley says its latest energy gum isn't for kids or anyone who may be sensitive to caffeine. A Wrigley spokesperson told CNN everything about the gum, from its price to its more bitter taste, is likely to make it unattractive to children or teen consumers. It will also urge stores to display the gum with energy drinks. And NBC C quoted the health watchdog group Center for Science and the Public Interest that noted one serving of caffeinated foods isn't likely to cause any serious harm, but the concern is that it will become too easy to consume copious amounts of caffeine throughout the day, sometimes unwittingly. Now, Wrigley says it'll cooperate with the FDA and that it markets the products for adult use. For Newsy, I'm Logan Tittle.